vocal tongue. I mean, you go. <laughs> I can't. Delicious. My journey. Vocal. I have tried so hard to be objective. This is not based on biases, but strictly on music, messages, music videos. If you want to know exactly what the criteria were, the detail behind it, and all of the songs that I've selected from, check the description. So I'm not going through all of the categories that you have voted on, because uh, otherwise the video will be too long. So check out my blog, I'll leave the link below so that you can see what your top choices were as well, and some of my kind of thoughts on that. This is based on messaging, musicality, and like their personal significance to me. I've put them in alphabetical order because I, I can't, I can't. I've done well enough to pick my top. I can't order it, maybe next year. <laughs> Okay, so the categories that we both agree on. So we've got best new female group or artist, and somehow we have literally ordered it the exact same way. We are twinning. <laughs> I think each of these groups on their own would probably win this category. It's just a case of, for me, when I look at all of their songs that they've come out with this year, their messaging, you know I'm big on messaging, all of that, I've just had to go with Le Seraphim because, I mean, I've said it enough. <laughs> I've said <laughs> No, I need to be right. <laughs> New K-pop girlies, wow. They kill this year. You said I agree with your top three, but I've kind of changed the order a little bit. Now, this category I really struggled with because I have seen Blackpink in concert. So for me to be unbiased is really, really difficult. Really, really, really difficult. I am too attached to their performances. So if I take them out of the mix, I'm gonna go with... For me, the lineup of songs the lineup of songs, the stylistic choices, the messages, the depth of the lyrics, some of, some of those lyrics just cut you and others are so soothing, the crazy sounds and just comforting vocals. I, as a body of work, I had to give it to this. Sexiest moment. I think it's funny how different people find different things sexy. And so in this list of the things that you said, some of it was like very overt crazy things and some of it was like really subtle things. You said...
I agree 100% with all of those, but we need to add some into that mix. Okay, this is where we disagree. You said yes, I'm mood. Mood. Tell me what you want, tell me what you need. Make you see the night box black and it's pink once the sun down. Me pull up, you know it's a shutdown. They are all really good choices but I have gone with the more cinematic options that I feel like they just go that step beyond the kind of K-pop staples and they just have some sort of impact and significance in different ways. So these are my top choices. Okay, so we've got Gorilla and Hala Halazia. Hal But 80s, when, especially this year, when it comes to just their storytelling within music videos, they take you on a whole journey. It feels like a mini movie. Uh, the colours, the extra characters that they introduce to it as well. It, it's just stunning. Cruel, the cinematography of it, the colours, the shading... Uh, the black and the uh, the red coming at you it, it's such a like visually pleasing and it's a sensory music video the detail of the and the scenes that you see, stylistic choices feel that he made very the unique and, and feel very detailed and determined uh, it's just too unique to not be on this list okay so here are your earworms of the year For me, there's only one choice. <laughs> there's only one choice, and it is Hype Boy by New Jeans. Originally, when I heard it, sonically, it wasn't my favourite out of their album, and it just got stuck in my head. That pre chorus, I just kept singing over and over and over again, and it's become one of my favourite songs from probably my favourite song from them now. If you haven't had it stuck in your head, you're not human. Who doesn't just want to be drifting away, taken on a journey because someone decided to open their mouth and sing. Oh, vocals, delicious. I can't comment on yours, so check the blog to see which ones you have selected. It's not that I disagree, I just can't comment on the ones that you have suggested. Again, alphabetical order, I can't order them. <laughs>
time. 24-7, you're dirty, I'm on time. Nine, cause you own it, it's not an in-born intro. Macho, catch a job with the photo, what's you know, baby? I'm still out. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Come young and sunshine. With the vocals, I have gone for a very different style because I think regardless of the style that the group choose to embody within this selection, there's something so unique, something so beautiful, or just something very impactful as well. There's rappers in this group as well, and it just really hits you. They take you on a journey, they take you into their own emotions, and I think that's what the strongest vocalists do. 